Hello everybody and welcome to Bellsport Thought Survival Guide and today in the DLC of Far Harbour we are going to be doing the quest Best Left Forgotten. We are continuing the main storyline now. So it turns out that Dima's earliest memories are in the hands of the Children of Atom. I need to access those memories and find out what's in them as they fear there are problems. Like he has he doesn't know what these memories are, but he worries that, you know, they'll get into the wrong hands, basically. So, we need to do this. So, you need to speak to Confessor Tectus. Or, you don't have to. You There are two ways you can do this, basically. So, you can speak to Confessor Tectus, which I will do. Excuse me, hi, Confessor? Yes. What is it, child? Those memories you've been wanting to access? I found a way to unlock them. You have? Atom above, child. I can only imagine what you had to do in order to lay your hands on such information. But understand that you are to bring anything you find directly to me. I will send word you're not to be impeded. And be careful. Too many of our brethren have fallen already trying to unlock the secrets of that accursed machine. So yes, um, he'll just basically say that. If you don't want him to know at all, which I don't think it really impacts anything, but if you do not want him to know at all, then you kind of just have to convince this woman who's guarding uh, the access door. Um, all the way up there. So we're gonna go. Da -da 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 -da. Around the back of the chemist place. Up here. Consider yourself warned. Caution, sister. Last child who tried to claim the secrets within roused the guardians of the base. So unless you've been tasked by. Yeah, so you you'd have to convince her, but don't fear, sister. Adam, I expect our fallen brethren thought the same. But if you wish to put your fate in Adam's hands, I will not stop you. May he watch over you. Oh, cool. Yeah, so you may have to convince her. Anyway, so you go to the nucleus command center. Okay. Oh, you just missed them. Jesus. Intruder, identify Contact. yourself. I died. Yeah. 
Great. So we've got to sell all that shit again. Up, over, up, down. Shit. I triggered it. Oh no. So it's just there. Open the door. And now we can go in. Auxiliary power offline. So we need to start the power. Ambush! Ambush! Defensive protocols engaged. Powers back online. Now this is where it gets really crazy, and we've got to kind of do something you would not expect to be doing in Fallout. Ready? So we've got one, two, three, four, five memories to get through. Icebreaker override. Because the image prototype to synth, these memories have more. Da, 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 da. Yeah, where are we? Oh, I can't click save. Okay. If you're listening to this, then you made it inside my memory banks. Take a moment. I know it's a lot at once. Alright, I kind of know what to do, so I'm just going to start, because this does take a while. The ar architecture you're seeing is data. My data. When I'm plugged into the chair, this is what I see. You're using an earlier version of that technology. A brainwave scanner instead of a direct neural wire. Look around. Do you see that yellow column in the distance? That's long-term memory storage. That's your goal. But you can't just retrieve that data yourself. One of the programs loaded in that holotape is called the Indexer. They're represented by the friendly green sprites milling around. Do you see them? The Indexers have one purpose, to get the data in the yellow column and bring it back to the memory access point. You need to help them get there and back safely. Once they've recovered all the data in the memory, the program will translate it into something you can understand. If you ever need to leave, oh, no. leave the simulation, then don't worry. Nothing gets reset. You 
can keep going from wherever you left off. So as soon as they go into there, it's going to register it as a breach. Because we're seen as an intruder. The system has been alerted to your presence. Now things will get hairier. You'll need to deploy defense constructs against the system's active countermeasures. The system's sentries will do everything they can to stop your indexers from returning to the access point with the data. There's one. Two, three, so it does twenty percent each time. So there'll be twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, and then one more should come back. There it is. And it'll come back, grab that and then go back. I oh know, sorry, a hundred already. Sentry initiating erasure of intrusive in Verifying memory file. One hundred percent. So we'll listen to each memory as we go. We now have an access point into the next memory. Just step into the data stream where this memory was stored. So what did he do? So what did he do to get Far Harbor on his side? So with each memory you need to uncover the truth behind it and what happened exactly. Um, so that's what we will be doing in the, probably the next episode. So there's our beautiful little sprites again. This is like a power source as you can see so if you go down here you can see it's blocking it it'll go into there go up and it will take whatever blocker is there now you want to make sure you set up defenses before There it is. There's the firewall. So that's what you want this decoder relay to do. Set it up there. Pull that out. And it'll destroy the firewall. There's another one. We need to build and now we need to place these so they can get across. But remember as soon as they reach it they're gonna start getting attacked. So you need to make sure they're protected. They should Sentry be okay has detected in this. active intrusive program. You're gonna want it there. And then you just wait. Ah oh, no. Sorry, I keep doing that. Intrusion detected. Countermeasures initiated. 
And then there'll be a hundred. Data breach detected. Initiating anti-intrusion countermeasures. That counts as it. So we'll just wait here. If one of them dies, they'll just come back. Intrusive program detected. Data block retrieved. Progress. Last one. Intrusive program detected. Here we go. Memory are. retrieval at 100%. Verifying. Looks good. You can now use the data stream as an access point to the next memory. Memory file identification 0J 2NN8. Converted to audio transcription. Beginning playback. I'm offloading this memory. I cannot bear mind to Confessor Martin and his children of Adam any longer. Better to just forget. I found it. The location of the launch key fire the nuclear missile inside the submarine. Confessor Martin believes it can bring his people into division. Destruction at the hands of an atomic blast. He struggles with how literal his interpretation of that precept should be. I can't risk him deciding to find the key and use it. His people were the first to accept me for what I am. Fills me with nothing but pain. Additional data appended. Location, the Harbor Grand Hotel State Room. Key code, 
Warning. Data breach detected. Intrusion countermeasures initiated. Sentry beginning erasure protocol against unauthorized indexer. Sentry has detected active intrusive program. Memory retrieval now at 60%. Another data block retrieved. One more to go. Complete memory retrieved. The data stream is now available to access the next memory. Memory file identification. 0H-3X0P. Converted to audio transcription. Beginning playback. I've made a contingency plan in case Far Harbor discovers the truth gives in to their xenophobia despite all my efforts. I've isolated the wind turbine powering Far Harbor's fog condensers. A kill switch command will leave them defenseless from the fog and its creatures. But now that it's done, am I really capable of this? This massacre that I've engineered? I'm going to remove the command code from my memories. I'll bury a hard copy if I need to use it. But I can't keep it close to me. It makes me sick. Additional location data appended. Coordinates to the kill switch command code and the wind farm maintenance building. So that's our ability. So that's our ability to kill off Far Harbor. The nuclear launch code was our ability to kill off um, the nucleus. And he also did something to Far Harbor, which is the reason he needed that security. Ooh. I kind of fell then. Well, that's what happens if you die. Okay, so the sprites are down here. There's our code relay. Decoder relay, sorry. Get all this. Don't know why that was broken. So we need to unblock there. So we need to
Okay, this is like a long stretch of road, so we're gonna need to be careful. So one, two, three, four, five, five bits of code. You notice each one of the rings disappear every time an indexer gets in. Come on. Come on, catch up you. Quick, quick. Come on, go, go, go. Why is it always the one that last one always falls behind? <laughs> that did not make sense, what the fuck I just said. Security alert. Intrusion detected in long term storage. Sentry has detected active intrusive program. Stop. Sentry has detected active intrusive program. Come on. First data block recovered. Good. Just keep doing what you're doing. Intrusive indexer detected. Sentry Look, has that detected one's active intrusive program. One of them must have died. I oh, know we're there. That's one hundred percent verified. Good job. All right, let's listen to you it. You can use the data stream to access the next memory, as usual. That sounded like he was a psychopath. Anyway, let's go on. So that's the proof Nick needed. That they were brothers. <coughs> okay, so that one's really, really close. Oh, shit. This is the worst one, this is. This is gonna take a while. Pfft. Let's click some blocks. You have to kind of remember which way to do it. So 
So, where's the green light? There it is. It's going down. We need to take out that one, then that. Get it over there so it goes down there. And get that going. If I can remember rightly. Alright, let's just start and we'll see where it takes us. I hate doing this when I first did it. Too low, it needs to go there. too high. And now you have to go back and lower it again. <clears throat> if I'm right, no I'm not. I need to go up one. I forgot I didn't put that extra one there. Don't worry, you won't have to redo it. I think this is in line with that one. Two, three. Turn around and get going. Take out.
Okay, sorry, I accidentally pressed the wrong button. Um, oh. So I'm gonna go this way. So where's the button on here? I don't know, we can't do this one yet. Missing a relay. There's one.
Oh, why can't I jump? Just let it like stop me. Right. Oh, so this is like the last one, just so you know. Sentry beginning erasure protocol against unauthorized indexer. Not shit, no. Security alert. Data breach detected. Countermeasures initiated. See, so yeah, that one took a very, very long time. So you obviously have to get over to there, then program. get to that one, move it over to there. And you kind of got to move these one ones more data block recovered. up to lock, unlock it, and then move it down. Complete memory retrieved. So let's listen to the last the simulation one. At any time. Memory file identification 0Y-8K7D. Converted to audio transcription. Beginning playback. I've discovered a curious record inside the pre-war data files of this submarine base. The Marines here were equipped with an advanced model of combat arms. There are several suits already in the base, in various states of deterioration. But there were more shipments of the armor on its way to the base the day the bombs fell. They could be in prime condition if the sealants have held. I have no use for them. But you never know. Maybe they'll be worth digging up one day. Additional data so yeah, this one is about getting some special, special marine armor. Exiting simulation in three, two, one. So you basically come out and then you have to begin unlocking this. So Demon's memories are pointing me to secrets he's hidden across the island. I need to investigate these as well as access his remaining memories to see what else he's hiding. I'm downloading each memory on a holotape in case I need to review it later. So the first one was uncover Demon's secret medical facility. This was about something he didn't want anyone to know about something he was going to do to make Far Harbor like the synths more. There was also the nuclear launch key which he feared the children of Atom would use like, on themselves to reach divination, divination, whatever the fuck it's called. There's also the wind farm kill switch codes which um, kill the fog condensers at Far Harbor. So that one will destroy Far Harbor the launch code would, the nuclear launch key, sorry, would kill the nucleus. And Demon's secret medical facility is his, his dark secret that could destroy Acadia. Um, and then we also have a miscellaneous one to find the marine combat armor shipments. I think in the next episode that's what we're going to do because there are, um, ain't not that. I think that's what we're going to do. Um, there's a few things that you need to go over so you'll find like the legs, the arms and like the chest in these locations. We'll also I think in the next episode go uh, for and investigate the Cranberry Island bog um, and we'll do that. And then I think we'll continue on Beth Left Forgotten and determine the fate of Far Harbour. Thank you for watching. This is Belle. And I did hope you liked this video and it provided you with useful tips on how to crack Dima's memories. This is Belle, thank you for watching and goodbye.